whether someone should come and work for Lampi, I would say yes, because you'll get family. Ambitious. Friendship. Motivational. Imaginative. Camaraderie. Togetherness. <laughs> <laughs> After I pay, should I sit? He smiles at it all. It's fantastic working where we are. Oh. I was going to say crazy, but no. Right. Crazy. Why is it motivational? Because it's sort of it's an inspiring company. It's like you're trying to achieve the best you can, and you're being pushed to do so. And we're trying to become, you know, the market leader in electrical testing, and that's our goal. All the departments are really interconnected. Um, although we're all separate, we, we share engineers and share ideas with each other. I think obviously sort of uh, reconfiguring the staff that we've got has helped a lot, creating more job roles to sort of like more fine tune the different areas of the business. Fundamentally, everybody cares. I think it, <clears throat> you, you, you can sort of see uh, that everyone has a vested interest into, into what we're trying to do and achieve. Obviously, you're, you're at the forefront as as doing that but then obviously you've got a management team and, and, and then in turn they have to trust the, the people who work in the other departments to all pull together and <clears throat> you know and, and make sure that everyone's doing the job to, you know, to to get where we need to be and what um, you know we can achieve what we want to achieve together as a company. What words best describe our site? Family.
we as a company, we have diff we use different ways to train people. So we have diff we have engineers in the northwest, we have them in the Midlands, we have them in um, obviously it's the southern engineers, and we also have them up, all the way up to Edinburgh, Newcastle. So what we do is on our platform we have um, different training days, so to speak. So we'll bring everyone together, or bring get out myself as a manager, we'll go to different engineers, to different areas, and we'll all come together so we can actually train each other, we can meet each other, we can be a part of everything. So we bring them together by basically just having training days, just to refresh everyone's minds, think of why, why, why are they here, what do they do, make them sure that they're valued as a member of staff, because I think trust as well is knowing that you are actually valued as an employee. If you don't feel like you're valued, you're not going to work to the best of your ability. So being valued as a member of staff is just so important. And I think that's what we try and do, make sure that everybody is valued. Trust between the colleagues, our colleagues and the management team, it's good. Um, it's got to be. You can't really operate if you don't have trust. So yeah, it's, it's always good. And that's probably one of the, one of the main things and the, the main, uh, the main showing, showing point that that shows. <coughs> I think everyone gets on well. There's a lot of sort of things that go on externally to work. Obviously, you know, people are all friends. People go out and socialise together. Um, yeah, we have team building days, which obviously helps to sort of boost morale in general. Um, obviously, you know, a lot of the engineers do as well. A lot of them are sort of close friends, and you know, it's, uh, it seems more like a sort of family, you know, as opposed to uh, a work environment. It definitely helps. For me, uh, in my role, we had a, one of the best months we ever had was when we hit we hit rock bottom. It was one of the best months we've ever had in like the, for the figures wise. 
So for me and for the team that I work in, I think that kind of spurred us on to think, do you know what, next month we're going to do even better. If we can work the way we've worked with limited resource, then the next month with the, better, most, the more knowledge that we have, we're going to work harder and we're going to effectively be a better team and be a better company. My team goals um, are sort of based on the operational requirements uh, that are also aligned with what our customers expect of us. So um, it's more, um, it's as oper operational as well as um, to meet customer satisfaction. Um, so these two sort of objectives align with, when setting my goals. Um, things like Trustpilot are tremendously important because um, they represent what our customers think of us. Um, the, the, the type of feedback that we get uh, ranges from um, a feedback of uh, the person um, who carried out the service to uh, the quality of the service itself or from the experience at the beginning um, or the end, so it's all ranges of feedback that could help us improve and also that could help and show other potential customers um, and anyone else that uh, we are reliable.
I think the relationship between the, uh, the office staff and the field engineers has got a lot better. Uh, we've created a lot more uh, regional supervisor jobs and regional manager jobs who look after smaller teams of engineers. Uh, they'll hold monthly meetings between themselves and obviously it gives the engineers a voice to then report back to the office uh, and obviously any sort of changes that can be made will then obviously be uh, sort of interpreted and uh, dealt with. Um, Yeah, I think everyone feels um, valued and um, feels like their opinions are worthwhile. Management always asks for our opinions um, on a wide, ra wide range of things and, um, and they always take, take our, our opinions on board. Um, one of the best things about working at Lime is definitely the people and the support they give you in no matter what it is, whether it's work related or not. But you can tell they really care about your future and they want you to succeed in what you're doing. Love coming to work every day, being in a fun environment, doing something that I'm quite passionate about and just everything about Lantai. I just love it. I love my job. When did you join Lantai? In 2017. 2017. 
And what did you come here to do? Uh, I came in to Lantide to see sort of what I wanted to do in the future. Uh, I've been in various different roles at Lantide and I feel quite settled in the marketing and sales role that I have. And what do you think about these apprenticeship expos? No, I think they're great because it gives people sort of an understanding of what an apprenticeship actually is. I think people have quite a bit of a misunderstanding on what an apprenticeship is, but um, you know, they come here and see that it's not what you know, the stereotype is. Um, I'd probably say that my best moment is when I won the Apprentice of the Year award in 2018. Um, showed that you know, I've worked really hard for it and that I got recognised for it as well, so that was pretty good. Did your mum shed a tear? No. Was she proud of a little boy? Yeah, I got a McDonald's for it and everything. Yeah, yeah. of course. <laughs>